Sergey El Flaco Bohachuk. And folks who haven't seen Bohachuk fight are going to like his style. He is uh, he's a thin man. The six bounces of professional. He is perfect. Six victories, all six wins coming by way of knockout. You got to kind of make an impression. Like Sergey Bohachuk was kind of came out of the blue, but Abel told me like this guy's really special. when Surrey became one of my favorite fighters to watch is that he got knocked down like a flash knockdown against Lucius Johnson. Oh, that was a good fight. He jumped up and then he knocked down Lucius Johnson. <laughs> Lucius was on the ground and he it wasn't a flash knockdown. He was actually still on the ground, but the referee was counting on Surrey because he was the one that went down first. And it was funny. I mean, they, they got back up. <laughs> by everyone by defeating the Cuban Olympic champion. Right. He was like a massive underdog, but he like against all odds, he just annihilated the dude. And that's why he got discovered and everyone heard about them, not only in Ukraine, not only in Russia, but also in the United States. <laughs> I destroy people. I destroy. He, he said it three times. I destroy people. And then he reiterated in boxing. Victories. Both wins coming by way of knockout. Boachu. What kind of thing? Over. I'd like to see them start to think so the distance can be subtle. It could be a half a step. So the quick one. There you go. A big shot. Except Pedrosa was weakening. Mammoth. The second one, even more so, it ends the fight. для Украины хочу сказать смотрите меня болейте за меня я буду стараться показывать вам хороший зрелищный бокс Hollywood Fight Nights he's here Ray Bowachuk is next on the queue but definitely with the uh, inaugural uh, Hollywood Fight Nights he turned some heads oh Woo! that was beautiful got some excellent technique now Oh, oh, and there's a left hook. Yeah. And he's he's never off oh, balance. Good oh, body no shot. body shot. What a variety. It's over. It's over. How about that last knockout? Surrey Bolchuk, 9-0 with that. High We have El Flaco versus El Salvaje. Zeher Bojchak versus Ronald Montez. Good luck, gentlemen. So we expect big things from Sergei. It's going to be great action-packed fights tomorrow night, and we're looking forward to seeing all of them. We're here tonight. We want to thank all the fans. Oh, and we also want to thank Takate. Without the sponsors, we couldn't put on shows like this, and especially want to thank the fans for coming out. MGM Resorts. Big knockout artist, Sergei Bojchak. So you guys get ready, it's fight All right, I'm, I'm going to say a young man that we've seen rise to prominence on this very series, Sergei Bowachuk. Maybe 11 the coast. Woo! Yeah. Sergei Bowachuk out of the Ukraine, 23 years old again.
is uh, Monte. Oh, actually, the taller man is just by a hair is Boachuk. But they match up very well physically. Oh, hook, the left right hook. hook, right in the mouth. Wow. Yeah. That's way in. Bad news for his opponents. Vamos, vamos! I'm fine. Easy. Easy fight. I am fine. Easy. Gracias, muchachos. Thank you. Thank you, guys. The Colombian was standing in his corner, and his legs were not there. They Ooh. were very stiff. He had a hard time sitting down. So he, it, was, it was a real shot. Carlos Hernandez. It's Marco Sergio Bohachuk. is in learning English. I make him learn. And don't be surprised if Bohachuk knocks him out in seriously less than two minutes. I'm. Oh, that is the built like that. Well, that's the amateur pedigree of this. Oh, they go body shot. You take an American trainer, put him with a European fighter. We're in trouble again. That's the key. Oh. Very technical. Um, he's walking down Carlos right now. You know, why let him? He can live to fight another day. Like, I mean, he's not even defending his. his yeah, I'm surprised the referee's not closer to the action. Oh, watching wow. Ooh, oh, him man, take this abuse. Why they just want him to continue? He's already been doing this. Goes forward and puts his head. Look, I, oh, well, there you go. There you go. Um, technician, buddy taught me how to fight, how to set traps. You are back. You ready for another knockout? Yes. <laughs> yes, I'm ready. Every fight, easy fight. Oh, wow. From Good, easy. Hard working, hard training, hard gym. Yes, a good opponent. I think maybe distance, maybe knockout. I, I show you tomorrow. Good luck to you. Thank you. All right, back to you guys. <laughs> I'm Doug Fisher, editor-in-chief of Ring Magazine, and with me, as always, a man needing no introduction, former WBC featherweight, featherweight. champion of the world, Kevin Kelly. Explosivo. It's undefeated middleweight fighting out of Big Bear, California. Sammy El Flaco Bohaju. So fast and, and flashy body work. And that's what Boa Chuck tries to do. Ooh, and he went down from a body shot. at junior middleweight. Oh, yeah, that right to the body. Actually, it was a left to the body because Boachuk is boxing out of an orthodox stance right now. Idea for you, Doug. Oh, and there was a right to the body landed by Boachuk. Tough. Dangerous. Well, I can hear those body shots. Oh! Big left hand connected. And Darvis has dropped for the second time in this fight. Right and a short right uppercut that helped set up yeah. that left hook. Right oh. There. oh, that's nice. Amazing. Wow. Oh, so it's over. Knock him out? That, that's exactly what I said. 13 knockout. 13 knockout. Easy fight. Thank you guys. Gracias, muchachos. <laughs> you guys get up for El Flaco, Serge Bohachuk. By way of 22 knockout, he's here to give his first. 
defeat to Serhe El Bohachuk. <laughs> First up on the scale is Freddy Ariel Hernandez. Serhe Bohachuk. Tomorrow night for Hollywood Fight Night. Я ощущаю это нормально, ничего особенного. Я бы сказал, что это трудный тест для меня. I feel like this is a pretty ordinary thing. I, I don't think this is a tough test for me. Really? Why do you say that? Потому что мне все легко. Because everything is easy for me. <laughs> it's easy. It's easy. Good luck. <laughs> what can I tell you? You know, I'm I'm ready. I'm gonna give this guy a good fight, and I'm hope I'm hoping that the fans will be happy. Yes, it's easy. Yes, this is easy. <laughs> he needs to put his arms up high because I'm gonna hit him hard. Thank you. Freddy Hernandez is coming. He's a proven veteran. He's got some great wins over uh, Angulo, amongst other world-class fighters. You know, this is a big test for Surrey. Keep his undefeated streak and his knockout streak alive. what he looked like two years ago, but he has changed. And what makes him a Mexican style boxer, he said to me, he has heart and two balls, so. Bowichuk is zeroing in with the right cross. He's landing it, throwing there exactly So there's right. no power behind there's that. None. You need the leg. But he's getting hit. Pressing forward, he's not the kind of guy to hold. He's not the kind of guy to grapple. And and so that type of fighter is, is the type of fighter that gets knocked out by a fighter like Bowichuk. Yeah, Bowichuk's going to the body and the head. And that, that's good strategy and good technique. These are some fearsome exchanges. Bowichuk, only 24, 13 and 0. Yeah. Both body. Oh, yeah. oh that. Yeah. Body shots. I cannot believe Freddie Hernandez made it to his feet. Oh, oh and they did. Wayne Hedgepath has seen enough. Bowichuk took his legs Both with that body shots, attack. Oh, As we look here, you take a look. The, you know, the body shot, they got a nice little. Right to the body and left to the body. I mean, amazing left hook. On the other side, the left uppercut, then a right, right body there shot. Go, then right the there. other side, a left, left to the body. 14 and 0, 14 straight knockouts. He's still undefeated. El Flaco Boachu. No, es un peleador joven, fuerte. Me sorprendió, me me tiró. Es fuerte. Sabíamos a lo que veníamos. No pude hacer mi trabajo. I think this is the most blood I've seen all over your shorts. No, it's not your blood. But I just wanted to tell you something. Last time you took interview from me, you said that the, it's possible that the fight will last for eight rounds. But I told you it's not going to last eight rounds. You cut through his guard with the right uppercut. Then you got him to the body right. Yes, absolutely. Freddy is a very tough and great boxer. And this was the toughest fight so far. So I'd like to express my gratitude to him. This was a great fight. So I will try to be better and better as I go. Was it easy? Maybe. <laughs> No, this is a good fight. No, not easy, in good fight. Good for me. Good for me, good experience for me. I like the way Bolchuk put things together. Yes. I like the body punching, the jab. He's got some tools that are very dangerous. So there's something for Abel Sanchez to work exactly. with there. Um, he, yeah, he absolutely loves this. He loves training. He loves he loves fighting. And I don't think he's being arrogant or anything like that. He's saying is it, it's easy come fight night because he puts the work, work in. And in. I've seen him in the gym. I've seen him who he spars with. I've seen him who he trains around top-notch guys. Europeans want box more global now. So take a West Coast producer, East Coast rapper. <laughs> you got to hit. Flaco, Serge Bohachuk, you're the Hollywood Fight Night King. Yes. He, Hollywood Fight Night King. You have headlined it six times and you have won six times, but your record is 14 0 by way of 14 knockouts. I won a knockout. Yes, for me, happy. This uh, Hollywood Fight Night, for me, same gym. I'm every time. <laughs> work, work, sparring, work. Big Bear, my second home. Come, come, my fight. I show my fans good boxing. Maybe show 15 knockouts. And it's Espanol. Next time. <laughs> Fans, 
want to thank all the fans for coming out tonight to support the Hollywood Fight Nights. Hope you guys enjoyed the show. Everyone looking forward to seeing El Flaco. We finally get to our main event. Round by round, minute by minute, round by round, fight by fight. Yes, i show you tomorrow. From Big Bear, Zeddy Bohachu! Self, like Triple G once did, of having Mexican style, trained by... Looking out to the... Spanish music. Forward Chuck had 150 amateur bouts. Good technician in there. But he does pride himself on the Mexican style, being a come forward fighter, and he's looking good. Forward Chuck loves to train, loves to run, loves to work out, loves to learn. I mean, fighting is fun to this guy. This is the 50th round, and, and oh, Chuck is relentless. He's not reckless with this guy. with the last. Oh, Chuck! Oh my goodness! But these are the oh guys. my god! I cannot believe Moran is taking these shots from Boachuk. Well, of course, Boachuk getting the better of these exchanges. Moran is firing back. Oh He's my goodness! Landing those hooks. Real close. Ready to step in. Oh Almost yeah! Stop. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, right. Future legitimate top 10 junior middleweight contender in Sergey Bojan. Let's go! You know, my plan was boxing, boxing and showing great boxing skills. You know, this opponent was really, really strong. I was hitting him so hard, and he was still standing. So this was a great practice for me. You know, I wasn't really thinking about that. I just came here to do my job. I showed my secret in the fight, and I hope my fans liked it. Thank you, my fans. Thank you to watching my fight, who come my fight. Thank you, my fans. Gracias, muchachos. Спасибо всем моим украинским фанатам, кто смотрел, кто не спал, кто болел за меня. This is your first 10 round fight. You thought you were going to go the distance. Did you anticipate to do an early knockout like you just did? You know, I wasn't really thinking about that. I just came here to do my job. WBC Continental America's title. Two big punchers. We know Tyrone Brunson. He holds the record for 19 first-round knockouts in a row. Sergey Bolachuk has 15 in a row with 15 knockouts. So it's going to be a lot of action tomorrow night at the Hollywood Fight Night. Night is exciting. So we're looking to see if uh, Bolachuk can keep his undefeated record, his perfect knockout streak, or if Tyrone Brunson. There's been a lot of upsets tonight. If it's fight night, guys! <laughs> All right, that was loud. Sorry about that. All right, well, oh, listen, uh, Cynthia set up the main event for us along with promoter Tom Loeffler. You can possibly give Serhiy Bohachuk his first loss. The game plan that we got, and we're going to execute it well, and I'm going I'm to beat this guy. You are now fighting for the WBC Continental Americas title, one of the coveted green belts. 200%. I'm ready for this fight, 200%. <laughs> Southern California, where really um, is. there is uh, obviously a huge uh, Mexican culture influence. Now, Boat Ukrainian music, but you know, he's going with the, the Spanish nickname El Flaco. And he's quite Bolchuk moves on. All right, the better, technically speaking, being a little more thoughtful with the punch selection. Now, Flacco, oh, 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 right, right hand to the temple, down. sends Brunson down. You know, Moacha, wow, light heavyweight, and um, that's where he works. Oh, oh right hand. down! Yeah. 
Look at his legs. Referee Thomas Taylor is taking a good look at him. Legs aren't fully under. He's got a little over a minute to the bar. Time on. He's got 13 seconds. Oh, oh. he's down. He got it. Spike uh, goes low enough. Good opponent, good fight for me. That not easy fight. This good fight, good practice for me. I'm I'm boxing. I'm good ready. I show good boxing today. Special for my fans. Special for my family. Special for my coach, my team. Yo, I'll give you my mic. You want give me, give me, please. Okay, okay. Thank you. <laughs> hey, thank you, my fans who come in my fight. Who are here? Thank you, my friends. Hey, thank you, Tom Loeffler. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Congratulations! Well, that speaks to an incredibly bright future for this young Oh, well, maybe we can start calling him a junior middleweight contender as opposed to a junior middleweight prospect. Uh, he was right on the cusp. You know, he just won that WBC Continental America's title. He rated number 12 in WBC as junior middleweight, number 10 in the IBF, 17 and 0 with 17 knockouts. Yeah, 100% knockout straight. Yeah. I see you running in the snow. Do you wear sh like snowshoes or? The, in Big Bear? When it's snowing, how many miles are you running? Monday, Friday, 10. <laughs> He's like, it's not really hard for me. I've been in Ukraine in the snow and the snow was on, on my knee and I was running in it and like in all sneakers and all like, it's nothing for me. I'm gonna still run. Like he was like so motivated and he was like, it was a challenge for him. And Sergey Bolichuk, the fighter from Ukraine, who you are training right now, 18 and 0, 18 knockouts. Tremendous amount of respect for Abel Sanchez. So I uh, decided to reach out to him and let him know that there's an opportunity for me to train to work with uh, Sergey Bolichuk, and and uh, uh, and he said, listen, you're gonna have a great time with this kid. This kid is very disciplined. You're gonna have a lot of fun, and I had. spoken about growing and becoming a better fighter. He's eager to learn and he understands. A lot of fighters in, in some cases they're undefeated. They think everything is going great but and they feel that there's not a need for change or a need to improve. He does he understands he's an undefeated fighter mm -hmm. but yet he's eager to learn, he's eager to become better. He understands that there's a lot more out there that he needs to learn. It's not just about being aggressive, it's about having control aggression. Mm -hmm. And so I want him to think a little more before he sets in, mm -hmm. then putting, putting his combinations together, working behind the jab, and then getting back on defense, timing, position, position to attack, mm -hmm. position to defend. To me, that's very important. So, and, and I've said this to him in the past, I don't want to change your style, I want to add to your style. I want to be helpful. Sergi Bohuchuk is, he's a pressure fighter. Little by little, start to wear you down and do damage until you cannot continue any longer. A, it's a it was a wild situation you, in the midst of the pandemic. You know, you guys pulled that off, and you had an actual fight under open skies. Mm -hmm. It was pouring, pouring rain. Point. Rain. The fight ended after round six, mm -hmm. and uh, with the TKO by Sergey Bochak. Look, whenever you fight somebody that's coming from Mexico City, you better be ready to fight because mm -hmm. these guys are always in shape because of the high altitude. On top of that, we're fighting in his country. Exactly. Let's not forget, <laughs> yeah, Sergey Bochak is from the Ukraine fighting exactly. in Mexico. So there's not a lot of people that are, are not a lot of fighters that are willing to travel to someone else's country and fight someone from that country. Pájaro Davila, el flaco Boca Tú. Como dice, está sentado en un barril de pólvora en cualquier momento, Bocachuk saca una mano y se puede dar la luz del pájaro David. Y está ganando.
ganando la pelea hasta ahora, Alex, el peleador ucraniano. ¿eh? Qué combate memorable, noche extraordinaria de boxeo. Muy bien, amigos, ya no va a salir. Ya no va a salir. Ya no va a salir el mexicano. Esta pelea va a terminar de Sergi, el flaco Bocachú. La victoria para el ucraniano, 18 triunfos. Sergi Bocachú está fighting Brandon Adams, who already fought Jamel Charlo for mm -hmm. for the title. We understand we're going to have our hands full uh, versus Brandon Adams. He's a crafty fighter, experienced fighter. You know, we want to take on these type of challenges. I have Brandon Adams. I have a December three fight. Good, good boxing style. Yeah, okay. not not easy. Right. Okay. And, I'm, and Brandon Adams make it good fight. Okay. In Dixie fight, I think this is for me. It doesn't matter. Okay. I'm I'm uh, now working. I'm ready. Ten rounds, twenty rounds. Doesn't yeah. matter. For me. It doesn't matter who uh, who have title. Yes. Who have title? I'm going. I need title. So I, I I won't beat champions. Right. Charlo. Yes. I think maybe next year I'm ready. I show I show my fans good fight. I show my fans interesting fight. This I have good opponent. I think maybe this is best fight for me in my career. I'm Sergey Bogachuk. Watch my fight December 3. Follow me on Twitter. I like talking for my fans.